That was a slap in the face! How are you gonna do that to me? Give me a bell sprout and show me a fucking Groudon? Yeah, at least we can sell these for some money. I think they're like 2,500 each or some shit. Got a bunch of Pokemon, let me battle with you. No. <laughs> You're gonna do it anyway, so why are you gonna even ask me? Wow, you can just have a bunch of Pokemon and then a bunch of Pokemon. Yo, luckily we got that hookup though. Only no vine with. I thought he can do something else. It was just using it just to, just because it was only attacking. I was hoping they had like absorb or something. switch between a party members really and without having to worry about any major consequences so far. Right, so we're probably not getting a Matang before before the first gym, but at least we have some variety. Just gonna hit you with this because fucking steel types can't be poisoned. Bastiodon. Um, let's keep the bell going. Let's keep all them out. Then we'll heal. Weirdo. And then we'll switch out to him. So I think he's ground rock or steel rock, so he should be weak to vine whip. He knew. He knew what was gonna happen. Whipping a rock dog. That cry sounds so weird. You go, weirdo. So, uh, Stacy? That's not very Let's not. Accept any fun numbers. Maybe we'll go back and pick them up. <sighs> Ampharos! Oh man. <sighs> I would have actually loved to have an Ampharos on the team. I have Sand True, not, not so much. Like there was all. If a lone Sand True existed, then yeah. Also, is there a Pokeball here? I think I'm going to also implement, implement the shiny clause, where if any shiny Pokemon comes up, I get to catch it. Oh, what's up, Lyra? Uh, I knew it was you. How'd you get past me? Here's something neat surprising me. First recorder, hooray! An item that we're never going to use, because the online is completely disabled for this game. Good talk, Lyra.
Uh, we cover the traditional buildings in here, that's why we've been Pokemon and Pokemon Center painted a bit somber when you blend in. Don't you like. Uh, oh, yeah, those... doesn't this do want to like trade something for like an Onyx or something? Tra uh, trading have also been randomized, so. Oh, yeah, I need to get a badge first before I can actually do the trade. But I randomized both Pokemon required and given through trades along with the held items, so. What's this, what's this dude over here in a fucking singlet? I'm thinking of the fucking Pokemon Trainer School in Jubilife City. What the fuck am I doing? Alright, so let's... What are you doing, Veneri? Alright, so I think we'll stop after Sprout Tower. So cool in this version. I would love to see this remade in like. I want it to have like a Pokemon Let's Go style remake, but have more realistic looking trainers from like Sun and Moon. Also, our first Pokemon here is a Snubble, so we're gonna have to catch that. Uh, see if it's a normal type. I might. Yeah, actually, yeah, we're gonna end up putting it in the PC, if anything. Two? Three? Um, I think I know what to call you. Oompa Loompa. She looked like an Oompa Loompa from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Man, that's upsetting. Oof. 
That twister effect looks so cool. Napoleon? Go weirdo! It's time to shine, boyo. I just now realized, even a little bit ago, this boy had a weeping bell. Which, I mean, it's not weird, it's just... Of all the Pokemon I could have randomized him to have a weeping bell at Bellsprout Tower. Okay. Huh. Wait, it looks like he was a cop. Also. Oh. Man, if we ever get a fucking Electra Buzz. Mmm. No. No, I'm gonna hit that up. on the PC. When it evolves, we're probably going to have to change its name since I'm not going to Oompa Loompa no more. So if you're wondering why I put them away in PC, it's because normal Muzlocks, um, you're only allowed to have one Pokemon of each typing on your team, and even though we're not going by 100% Muzlock rules, I want to at least try to keep my team balanced with different typings as well, so I want to try following that to, to some extent. Like, if we get to a point where everything is dead and we have like two normal type Pokemon, I'm not just gonna put one on my team. I don't know why I put it like that, especially if we're not going with a dead Pokemon rule. Dreadplate. Cool, for whenever I get that Arceus that I totally won't get. Relicant. I love Relicant. Uh, so far we're getting a lot of cool Pokemon that I just fucking adore. Relicant, Relicant is definitely like probably my top favorite water Pokemon right there. Probably just because I'm obsessed with uh, Seelicant. The fish that can walk on land or whatever and a prehistoric and shit. Those things are fucking cool. Wormadan. Uh, let's go with Metalhead. Sorry about that scritchy sound, it's me itching my beard. Wormadan's cool. You know, I'm not the biggest fan of Gen 4, but I just, there's a lot of designs I just love. Yo, you have accuracy of 95, what are you doing?
mining. Uh, let's take another hide. I want to try to see how far I can get him to level 20. Or how fast I can get him to level 20. Good job, policeman. Doing the job, protecting those people. 